Good afternoon, Bears. This is the Friday edition of the WBBN News. I'm Weston. And I'm DeAndre. We have a lot going on, so please listen up. Are you interested in a career in healthcare, thinking of becoming a certified nursing assistant? Applications are now available for juniors who would like to apply for the next school year. The deadline for submitting these applications is Friday, March 12th. See Mrs. Carabello in room 666 for more information. Tutoring is available for students with an active IEP virtually in the evening and on the weekends. Please contact Ms. Chamberlain in room 602 or email at chamberlain.show at brevardschools.org for more information. Brevard Schools Foundation has awarded more than 1,000 scholarships to graduating seniors valued over $900,000. This year, there are 53 scholarships seniors can apply for. Awards vary from $500 to $3,000. Get started today by logging onto the website below to create an account and begin the application process. Application deadlines are March 15th. We'll be right back after this. Any student interested in pursuing a career in the medical field after high school should pay attention to the following course information. Medical Terminology is an Eastern Florida State College academic dual enrollment class that the students take on Bayside's campus. Over the course of the semester, students will learn almost 2,000 medical terms and definitions as related to the systems of the body. Medical Terminology slash Introduction to Healthcare is only available for 11th and 12th graders with a 2.5 GPA. Patient Care Technician is an Eastern Florida State College vocational class offered to Bayside to seniors. The class teaches 15 students how to become nursing assistants with clinical training at the nursing homes and hospitals. Patient care assistant students learn to give baths, transfer patients in and out of bed, and perform blood pressure tests. They will learn to check pulse, respirations, and temperatures. In addition, students will practice making beds and feeding patients. Eastern Florida State College requires testing and orientation to enter their programs and also have additional requirements as far as grades and absences. If you are interested in taking any of these courses, stop by Ms. Caraballo's room, 666, for more information. And we're back. Any student that will be a senior next school year and is interested in doing early admission at Eastern Florida needs to see Ms. Emil in guidance during lunch for an application packet. The deadline to buy your book is quickly approaching. The last day to purchase a copy is March 30th. They are $80 and can be bought online at yearbookforever.com. This past week, several Bayside students participated in the Wise South Regional Science and Engineering Fair. The students receive approximately eight. $385,000 in scholarship and prizes this year. Mr. Mitchell would like to give a special thanks to Ms. Muse, Mrs. Davidson, Mrs. Martin, and Mrs. Fleming for all their assistance this year. That wraps up this week's edition of WBBN News. Make sure you like us on Facebook, follow us on Instagram, and subscribe to our YouTube channel at Bayside WBBN. Have a great weekend, Bears.